Hi folks, uh, I'm Ben. I'm a lifelong loyal West Virginia Republican. I wasn't gonna make one of these videos. I've already voted for Joe Biden. I voted for him because I think Donald Trump is a fake. I think he's a fake billionaire. If he were a real billionaire, he would have showed us his uh, tax returns. I figure he's gonna be broke when his administration ends. I think he's a fake president. Real presidents don't uh, coddle up to dictators in China and Russia and North Korea, and they don't annoy our allies in Europe and our uh, neighbors in Canada and Mexico. Real presidents reach across the aisle and do the hard work it takes to govern. They don't just watch television and tweet. Um, more importantly for our purposes, I think he's a fake Republican. He was never much of a Republican in New York when he was giving money to Democrats uh, until he decided that he could use our party to meet his need for personal gratification. A real Republican president would oppose the kind of deficits he's run up, would favor the kind of free trade he's uh, interrupted, and would have a party convention where he actually adopted a platform, which we didn't even do. On top of that, the guy can't spell for me. So I've thought for a long time that he is figuratively destroying our party, killing our party. But today I'm making this because I think he's literally killing our party. Coronavirus is on the rampage. It's growing, it's expanding all over the country and particularly in a lot of Republican states. And this guy spends more time on his Corona hairdo, I think, than he does on the coronavirus. It's his virus and we named it after him. But what he's doing is turning our party into the sad party, sickness and death. He's asking all of you to come to these live rallies where we know, which we know will be super spreader events. People will bring the virus, they'll share it with each other, they'll take it home to share with their families. We can do better, we gotta do better for the sake of your families and your communities and your state and your country and in fact, the world. Please, don't go to these rallies. Don't vote for this guy use words that we as Republicans understand. To Donald Trump, just say no. To Donald Trump, in his own words, say, you're fired. And pray to God that Joe Biden and Kamala Harris can take this mess Trump has created and actually make America great again.